huge farm to grow fresh produce. No, you only need a little bit of space and a lot of hard work. Hope, uh, Sipla, I think we had your name uh, wrong the first time. It's Sipla, is that right, Hope? Hello, Hope. Can you hear us? Uh-oh, we're oh. having issues. The thing with the deal is not connected with the thing uh, with the yeah. thing. We gotta beep the boop again. We gotta beep the boop again. <laughs> Hope, can you hear us? There I go. Oh, there, there you are. Go. I can, can hear you now. Hi, oh, hey. Hope. Hey, I wanted to make sure. Are Hi. we getting your name correct? Is it Sipla? I think we had it wrong the first time. Yeah, Sipla. Got it. Okay. All right. All right. So, uh, Fiery Ginger Farm uh, is where we are right now. You told us two acres where you're growing all this fantastic yes. produce. Yes. Now, it's called Fiery Ginger Farms. Could you lift up the hat? I got a feeling I know why it's called <laughs> that. Uh, That's a terrible Oh, yay! Yeah. <laughs> there it is. There it is. We love gingers around here. <laughs> my, husband, my husband came up with that name. Everybody I know says that it's fitting. Uh, it is. And my poor business partner, Shane, who's not here right now, uh, got stuck with it. So. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Okay, so we want to know, as far as uh, growing the produce, because obviously it, it takes a lot yeah. of effort and a lot of know-how to grow the food that you're growing, especially for these schools. How did you get into farming in the first place? Like, is, Have you always had a green thumb? Um, so I'm originally from Michigan. I moved here 11 years ago and in the Midwest you can, it's a really short growing season. Mm. But when I moved here, uh, I started working with my kids school gardens and from there I moved on to managing a school farm and I just kind of learned that way how to grow food and realized in working with the school farm that I really wanted to grow on a big scale. So yeah. that's kind of how I got into farming. Now yeah, using and then mixing the education because I worked on a school farm. So, I got you. Yeah. I got you. Now using your hand, show us what part of Michigan you're from. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I really hate that when everybody does that. I'm just gonna grab that. <laughs> Watch it, Cody, before she gets fired again. Know, She'll get fired. I'm, I'm pushing my luck here. I grew up in Kalamazoo. <laughs> Kalamazoo. Okay, so what, what do you got? What you, what yes, you got growing really behind you? Yes, there really is a Kalamazoo. There? What you got growing behind you there? Uh, so this is lettuce. Lettuce, okay. Lettuce and uh, some bush beans over there, and then on the far side, on the trellises, are some cucumbers, which uh, was a trellising experiment this year. They're growing great. Ooh. Oh, good. Uh, like I said earlier, lettuce is our biggest crop, and mm -hmm. we saw it in a cut leaf lettuce mix. Well, and we've talked to farmers before, you know, the, the weather can work with you or it can hinder you. How has yeah. it been with these triple digit temperatures? Yes. Uh, it's been, uh, for us, it's okay. As you can see, we shade things. Yeah. Uh, lettuce is really sensitive in the summer. Most people in the valley don't grow it at all. Uh, we're just uh, d stubborn enough to try. And so we <laughs> cover it with shade. And we also have these high tunnels on the other side of the farm. Uh, that allow us to do that in the summer and you know just watering for short periods of time a couple times a day usually so it takes some water for sure yeah yeah well we love what you're doing uh and, and we love the fact that you're not only fiery but stubborn it's self-admittedly you said stubborn <laughs> that's what it takes to be a it's successful true. farmer very stubborn. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you're fantastic thank you for everything that you're doing for these schools as well getting that fresh produce to the kids thanks Oh, we love it. All right, stay cool out there. It's going to be a hot one today. Oh, yeah, for sure. We will. Right. Oh, yeah. She's great. I love her.